So are you gonna work through St. Patrick's Day? Don't you want to celebrate Ireland's great accomplishments like Michael Lohan and vomiting into a bagpipe? Wow, I meant so I take it. You will not be wearing green tomorrow. I will be wearing head to toe orange in honor of Protestant William of Orange, inventor of the orange, according to Yahoo Answers. You in orange, you look like a cream sickle with an old tooth stuck in it. <laughs> well, you'll never see me, because I don't leave my house on St. Patrick's Day. Chris and I are going to ride out Hurricane Shamrock, holed up in my apartment, laughing at excerpts from Angela's ashes. You know, some people might find your attitude offensive. Oh, what are they going to do about it? Write a meandering play about how amazing the Irish are at not overcoming adversity? Well, I'm sorry we can't all belong to ethnic groups as beloved as the Germans. Please, without Germans, you wouldn't have any of the Indiana Jones movies. Lemon, your secret love of the Irish is well documented. After all, I am your mentor. You dated Dennis Duffy. And in the 90s, you gave money to the IRA. I thought I was contributing to a retirement account. You know, I think someone needs to learn a St. Patrick's Day lesson. What is that? A curse? Take it back, you witch! This American Life, Saturday, March 17th, St. Patrick's Day. You know, everybody complains about the weather, but today on the program we meet somebody who actually... Hey, what are you doing? Get out of my studio! Happy St. Patrick's Day! Let go of me! Didn't you hear my show? I'm bullying! Hey, Chris! Watch this! Megan! Spin around, they're so confused. Awesome. It's too many Megans, right? I love you. Uh-huh. I just ordered Thai food. How much do you love me now? Man, they're fast. You know what? I can't wait till the Asians take over. Thank God for delivery, keeping us inside and safe from all the Irish nonsense. Hey, dummy. The curse. What's up? I'm Dennis, a former lover of Liz's. Oh. I tried to steal beer from a Dwayne Reed and some black guy cold cocked me. Oh, like a security guard? I don't know, pal. I'll see people that way. Uh, no, no, uh, no! Hot dog truck, huh? I'm an entrepreneur, too. I got this new business where I burn your old DVDs on a laser disc. Oh, Dennis, I don't think you should be drinking with a head injury. Mm. <laughs> That's a good lizard impression, Chris. She is a bummer. Well, 911 is still busy. What could be causing so many medical emergencies today? Oh, right, an Irish religious festival. Irish pride, go Celtic. Celtic suck, go Knicks. As soon as I get through, I'm getting you an ambulance, and you are out of here, Dennis. No, 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 no. I can't get into an ambulance. I don't have health insurance because of Obama. Look, Liz, I don't think he needs to go to the hospital for a concussion. I was a volunteer EMT. At Burning Man, and we agreed never to talk about that. At sunset, the cacti start to resemble people looking for hugs. It gets ugly, Liz. You know, there's some things I miss about being with you. Like having somewhere to hook my Sega up to. But this constant judgment, Chris, deserves better. Chris, may I speak to you alone for a minute? No. Anything you need to say to him, you can say in front of me. Me and Chris, we're bang brothers. Oh. Why are you being nice to him? What, you want me to be jealous? I'm not that guy. I'm this guy. No, you need to know something. Dennis Duffy is like the Terminator with cheaper sunglasses. He just keeps coming back because his potato brain thinks he still has a chance with me. Hey, Liz, you'll be back. If I ever see you again, I'll kill you. You'll be back? Never again. You'll be back, Liz Lemon. You'll be back. And I'm not kicking Dennis out of here in his condition. Guy with a concussion on St. Patrick's Day is like a horse with a broken leg. Exactly, we should shoot him. Don't you see what he's doing? He's already driving a wedge between us. Chris, get in here. There's a Les movie on Showtime. Um. <laughs>